Yuasawa Spounds here with a quick farming guide for Gavial's event. So there are three main farming stages in this event. First one being RI-6 for Oriroc clusters. Now this one is actually slightly less efficient than what we currently have, that being 1-7. So ideally you don't want to be farming this stage, but it is an option. Now there are two other great stages that you should be farming and those are RI-7 for sugar packs, great value on this one and the same goes for RI-8 for RMA, this one also has great value and since RMA is harder to come by I would recommend going for RMA first. But let's also check out the numbers. Here we have Moose's farming table and we can see that stage number 6 is not the best with an efficiency of 0.98 and then we have stage 7 and 8 really good value with an efficiency of 1.1. For um, So for this event I would recommend farming mainly stage number 8 for RMA. I think this one is going to be the best value and if, if you really need sugar packs, I would go for those as well, but mainly I would stick to the RMA. Now, here's the deal about the Ori Rock clusters. In terms of efficiency, you'll, you'll still want to go to 1-7. 1-7 is still the best map. You can see here, this one has the efficiency of 1. But for Ori Rock clusters, RI-6, we can see here that for uh, this material in particular, so if you need lots of Ori Rock clusters and you need them fast, RI-6 is the best stage to farm them. You can uh, get Ori Rock clusters for 19 sanity here and yeah, uh, what else do we have? 2-4, this one is 28 sanity so it is uh, very fast in terms of obtaining Ori Rock clusters, but if you are worried about being efficient, you would rather go, you should rather go to 1-7, farm the small rocks there, and then uh, craft the Ori Rock clusters in the workshop. That way you get the better value. But um, yeah, as I said, if you wanna get these fast, this map is actually useful and you do get the event currency as well. So that uh, is a plus. Uh, we can also check uh, the other items here. So we have a sugar pack in RI-7. Uh, we can see that it is uh, indeed the best currently for sugar packs and we know that it is efficient. So win-win uh, situation there. And then for RMA, same thing. RI-80 is the best for obtaining this particular item as well as uh, a very efficient stage to farm indeed. Now there is also a fourth stage. If somehow you don't need to farm any of these three stages, there is stage number four. This one you can farm some rocks here and just uh, turn those into a random while you are getting your currency, but the value is uh, really bad on this one. So just grab your currency and then if you want to keep continue farming or run them, you want to go to 1-7 instead. And just to show you real quick here for all rock cubes, in 1-7 we have a 4.8 sanity required per item and then um, the, uh, the stage RI-4 is very low on the list as you can see with 14.4. So uh, in terms of just a random farming, uh, <laughs> this is going to be a lot worse than 1-7. And one last thing, if you're unsure how many materials you need to farm, I recommend using a planner. You can uh, use the one on GamePress or something like arc-knights.com. But yeah, any planner works and that way you will know how many materials you need to farm exactly, which is really, really helpful indeed. Alright guys, so that's gonna be the video. RI-8 is the king, so farm it while it's still open. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to like and subscribe. And if you need help with clearing the event stages, you can check out the links in the description below. Thank you for watching 
and I'll catch you guys next time. Have a good one and take care.